This is one of my favorite Hot Wheels cars. Which do you think will hit the ground first, me or the car? Today on Hot Wheels Labs, we're talking about wind resistance. So, what hit the ground first? The car. Why would a tiny car fall faster than a much larger scientist? Because you had a parachute. Yes, it's because of resistance. Wind resistance. What's wind resistance? Well, when I jumped out of that airplane, gravity pulled me and the car down, but the air was pushing back up against us. You see, air is actually made of tiny molecules. They're just too small for us to see, but they can slow us down. This is called resistance. And because I had a big parachute, there was more surface area for the air to push against, so there was more air resistance to slow me down. In fact, anything that travels through another substance encounters resistance. To demonstrate, we're gonna need to build a Hot Wheels track. Yes! So, we know air has resistance. What about water? Oh, it really slowed down. Yeah, that's because water has even more resistance than air. Because it has a higher density of molecules. Or more stuff is in the way. What else has resistance? Notice how the Hot Wheels car slows down differently each time. So different materials have different resistance? Precisely. On Earth, you can't escape resistance. In fact, the only place you won't find resistance is where there's no air, like outer space. Don't forget to watch more Hot Wheels Labs! <laughs>